Hey, this is Steve with Entering Into Space, and uh, a couple got a couple things in the day to hopefully improve my video quality. So I'm gonna do some tests. Some just this is totally impromptu because the, the uh, Amazon person lady thing showed up like not too long ago, and so I'm super excited. Anyway, uh, so the two things I'm gonna be testing and do some comparisons are uh, the first thing is the Purple Panda lav mic so right now i'm on the rode video mic go and it sucks it's okay but it's really uh susceptible to wi-fi interference like bad so if you're watching this and you're like ooh, 70 dollars for a rode mic don't do it don't do it uh the other thing is to improve hopefully the video quality and maybe do some uh some videos coming up of uh, some Milky Way shots. We got the uh, the Roken on 14 millimeter 2.8 wide field, and hopefully that will allow me to use my uh, astronomic CLS clipping filter for when I do some wide field Milky Way shots. So I can actually uh, also introduce some light pollution production with that clipping filter. So right now, what I want to do is um, I'm going to switch out the mics and see if the audio quality is better. Actually, before I do that, let's do an unboxing. Why not? I mean, so Purple Panda, let's unbox it first. Got a nice little, uh, what was that, like a Crown Royal back? <laughs> uh, let's see what we got inside of it. See, look at this, like I'm, like, I'm using a kit lens. It's the 58 millimeter kit lens that comes with camera. Comes with camera, Canon, and so, See, I'm gonna like hold everything up anyway, so you can see it. And it's probably not focusing very well. Uh, in the bag, instructions. The reason that I went with this extra one is I bought just like a cheap lav. I don't know if it was a lava there, Mike. I don't think it was. But it worked great right on my cell phone, but not on my Canon at all. So, what's in the bag? Here's the a little microphone clip. I think it's got like, like six or eight feet of uh, cable to get you away from the camera. I don't know what that is. That's where I usually plug. That's what I usually plug in on the camera to control it. So we'll see. Um, so here's the microphone. Get an extra clip. Get a little fuzzy, fuzzy windbreaker. Uh, male to female extension, and then male to female extension cable so let's uh let's get it hooked up and then we'll do the unboxing with this mic and we'll check out the unboxing on the lens why not okay how does this sound is it better is my audio quality better because it freaking better be anyway i'm so tired of bad audio i'm really trying people uh so this little piece, I found out what it's for because I read, I read the directions. This is for like a GoPro. I don't need this. Yeah, I'm not focused. There I am. Uh, this is for like a GoPro. So we don't need this because right now I'm using the Canon T5i. That's what I'm shooting on. I'm shooting uh, 24 frames a second. I changed that too. I don't know if you can tell. So cool. Uh, I guess this is for like really windy, wind, like super windy days. Which it's not. Hey, stop chewing on the fence. No. Uh, <laughs> that's fluffy. Anyway, um, so that's the purple panda mic by Lava Layer. Got it from Amazon. I don't know what we did before Amazon, I swear. So um, I'm gonna have to go out there and scream my dog. I'll be right back. Okay, cool. So, uh, oh, dogs. Anyway, uh, so let's unbox the Rokinon 14 millimeter F2.8. Um, box. Foam. Cool. Wow, that thing's actually heavy. This thing is a lot heavier than I thought it was gonna be, which is a little concerning because if I'm vlogging, um, which sometimes I do, sometimes, like, it's gonna be pretty heavy out at the end of the 
little thingy that I hold on to. So, just so you know, it's like, that weighs more than the camera. Yes, I'm harping about the weight. But, it's a super wide feel. So, comes with a nice little, uh, ooh, look. And yeah, this thing is pretty cool. Uh, $350, so not too bad. And so I noticed like the EFS lenses that I'm using that I'm shooting on right now, they will not, they're too deep. So if you put the clip-in filter, like an astronomic clip-in filter like I talked about before, if you put that in there, you can't seat the lens. So hopefully this is, is narrower, I hope. So we're gonna try that out. The focus action is actually a lot better than the lens I have now. It's, it's very stiff, which is really good. Um, but guess what it doesn't have? Autofocus. It just doesn't. But that's fine. We'll just have to figure that out. Um, but it's worth it to have a better lens. So what else do we have in the box? Yeah. More doodads. This is like an oven mitt for cookies. More bags. I have more bags and twisted ties and black pieces and spacer pieces and caps and cups and instructions from this hobby of astrophotography. I got more foam. This thing is really packed well. I'm impressed. Anyway, so I'm gonna pause it. I'm gonna put the Rokin on um, 14 millimeter lens on and see what the difference is. <laughs> so what do you think? So this is the Rokinon f2.8 uh, 14 millimeter super wide angle lens. And uh, yes, it's definitely wider angle. So we've got the lavalier mic, purple panda. We've got the uh, Rokinon wide angle lens. Um, I think I have it anyway. So this was the lens that I was using before, just a little Canon kit lens. Works okay, but uh, hopefully this will this will be better. This will improve the video quality and uh, allow me to get some some really cool wide-angle shots of uh, the Milky Way in the future. Um, the only thing I'm going to test is the clip-in filter. So let's do that now. It's going to make the image look a little funky, probably. Where'd that come from? Clothes are dry. Uh, and then I think that'll conclude this little impromptu video. All right, stay tuned. What do you think? It works? Yeah. Uh, yeah, works good. You can tell I got like a little teal purplish blue cast over me, which is uh, what I had to edit out in post-processing in Photoshop with this filter, but it does a really good job of uh, separating out the uh, light pollution and uh, enhancing the contrast. So, so cool. We've had a productive little video today, haven't we? Um, the, where's my recap stuff? Oh my God, I gotta pull the bag up. So the purple panda, uh, I'm gonna check this out, but it sounds good just from the camera. The um, broken on, 14 millimeter, super wide angle by Samyang. Both of these were actually purchased on Amazon. Um, try to purchase as little as I can, but man, you can't beat it sometimes. I literally hit buy yesterday afternoon. So, uh, yeah. So I guess that'll conclude this video. Looks like everything tested out well. And hopefully I can uh, follow up with some uh, stills. I think it's gonna be too cloudy tonight, but maybe soon, a couple nights, I'll have some stills of some starscapes. Thanks for watching. Oh, and while the dog chews on a plastic bottle, I'm over 250 subscribers now. I'm blown. I'm so thankful and appreciative, especially since my dog likes to chew bottles during my thank you speech. Anyway, thanks guys. Appreciate it.